<laughs> that was a massive hook set. I have no idea what I got. But whatever it is, he has got some weight to him. Unbelievable. This is one strong fish, whatever it is. I have no idea. And that's the beauty of saltwater fishing. I have no idea what I've got here, folks. But I do know he's peeled and dragged. He is definitely he's got some weight to him. Oh boy. Where is he? I can't even, I can't even move him. Oh there he is. Oh it's just it's a big sea bass. He just or is it a two tog? I think it's a two tog. There he is right there, it's a two tog. Okay, no wonder he was fighting so strong. There we go. Nice, wow, that was a strong fight. Okay. There we have it right there. That's one nice two tog. Boy, are they ever strong. They are really, really strong. But you know where he's going? Right in the box. Now there's a sea bass. Wow, he gave me a really good fight. Nice. Beautiful bass. That's a dandy fell. Wow, that took me like five minutes to get him in. Amazing. They do fight strong, don't they? Oh yeah. That's a good hook set with that bullet jigger. Beautiful. Right in the box he goes. That was a good one, Phil. Right on. That was a nice one. Just a solid, solid thunk. I love it when that happens. You got one too? He's dogging it down there. Oh! Need a net for that evil? Oh, I'm gonna need a net for sure. Oh man. What do you got on? I think it's just a big sea bass, but he does not want to come in. There he is oh, there. Well, nice it's, one, no, it's not even that big, but it's a decent one. Nice one. He just didn't want to come in. There we go. Not as big as I thought, but nice fish nonetheless. So, oh, that was pretty good. We're fishing in, let's see here, 24 feet of water. Water temperature is 65 degrees. Spring came a little bit early this year. A little warmer than normal, but uh, it's working nonetheless. We're gonna stay in this 20 foot zone and uh, keep working this area and hopefully we'll get into some more, uh, some more nice fish. Grab the net, Phil. This is a fluke. This is a fluke, and I don't want to lose him. He just might measure. You ready? Yes. Beauty. Oh, we almost jumped out of the net. Look at that. One doormat. Well, I don't know if it's quite doormat status, but big enough for me. Maybe for smaller holes? Oh, maybe. Whoa, look at him go crazy now. Okay, let's... I gotta get this guy measured up. Nice. Oh boy, oh boy. Close the mouth. Yes. 19 inches. Oh boy. Some fine eating right there, Phil. Great. Look at how they're white on the bottom side. That's the side, of course, that sits on the bottom of the, uh, the uh, sea. And then their top side, what they do is they, uh, they take the, uh, the color of, the, of what they're sitting in. And what they're sitting in right now is uh, sand, sand and or mud. So that's why they've got that coloration in there. That's a nice fish too, Phil. Yeah, these fish have just turned on with that wind shift. And I think as well, this southeast wind is more of a predominant wind out here. And these fish just turn right on. That's a nice sea bass. Yep. Beauty. Wow, what's he coughing up? There we go, oh, coughing up something. Squid. Okay, he's got my squid. He's coughing up your squid. That's yeah. he's coughing up your squid. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's a nice one. Oh yeah, decent fish. Viper spoon with the squid. What size viper spoon is that? That's a that's SP4. A SP4, yeah. The whole squid fits very nicely. Well, oh, you put a whole squid on there. Yeah. Good idea. 
case there's a fluke around. Yeah. Nice. I'll take some sea bass. That's a big male. See the males. You can tell always tell the male because they've got that uh, hump, that little hump on the back of their head, whereas the females do not. Kind of like the hump on my nose. Kind of like the hump on your nose. <laughs> actually, these fish they all start off as female, and then they change. Actually, they change sex after. Uh, uh, I'm not sure how many years, but they do change and they all become uh, males after a certain point. Blue fish, Evo. Blue? Nice. That was awesome. Just flat lining it off the back of the boat. Nice. Had a black sea bass in my bowl of jigger. <laughs> and then this thing went screaming. That was awesome. You gotta love that. That's a nice blue. Not bad. Beautiful. And that titanium wire line done its job. Oh, yeah. Nice. Little guy, but a lot of fun. Nice. There's another good fish, Phil. Right yes, sir. I'm telling you, this chop has really fired these fish up. This feels like a decent fish, too. Unless, like that other one I had earlier, it's just a fighter. Oh, he's dogging it. Oh, it's an AC bass, Phil. Wow. There we go. That's a nice sea bass. Decent. They look bigger in the water. <laughs> That's what. Oh, you got one too? Beautiful. Oh, he's dogging it too, isn't he? Okay, I'll get uh, get him in the box. We'll get yours landed. That's a nice fish. I don't know if he'll measure. I think he's, he's a bit small. Catch and release, but this guy's going in the box. <laughs> 